Hey guys, I'm Zimiyoshi. Welcome to yet another Pokemon Fire Red uh, gameplay. Hey guys, I'm Princess Daisy. The thing is, we have reached Giovanni and now it's time to face him and get the Sylph scope. The thing is, seeing Red is... Um... Yeah, seeing of course uh, Red is uh, fainted. We're gonna be switching uh, into Primeape and we're gonna also... Uh... Actually, no. Yeah, we have to. Good idea. By the way, I'm not sure. I, I'm I'm pretty curious how you do uh, against the, the boss Giovanni. Yeah. I'm not sure how many Pokemon he has, but he is definitely also going to be something that we will be uh, meeting pretty soon. Oh, an Onyx. Well, well, Donkey Kong can easily uh, get this with like an Aerial Ace. I'm not sure if Aerial Ace would do it, and I'm. No, Aerial Ace is definitely not the right move. He probably needed like Karate Chop or something. Brick Break is probably the right one to do. Yeah, Brick Break, that's the one. Oh, and of course, when I tried using that, I'm paralyzed. Yeah, you have you have paralysis, so that's pretty annoying. Yeah. All right, finally, this Onyx is rid of. Thank goodness, because this guy was very annoying. I did start at the timer a little bit too late, so I'm already uh, down uh, in seconds. Well, we're gonna be mo moving into Blastoise, because um, we don't have Surf, but uh, this but this Rhyhorn is, it can definitely not take a Water Pulse. Are, are you serious? Of course, Stupid Paralysis. Yeah, but he didn't do much damage at us. And uh, Water Pulse as well, that's just a one-hit KO. Yep. By the way, when I got the Silph Scope, I'm just gonna be uh, moving over. And he has a a king. Uh, skin. Yeah, I don't know how to spell his name. I'm probably gonna be using Bite on this one. He missed. Well, Bite was probably maybe the smart thing to do. I'm not really sure. Oh, he uses Bite on me, and I flinched. Great. And now it uses Tail Weep like a uh, idiot. You do gotta be a little bit careful because Blastoise is uh, pretty much uh, is paralyzed. How much does Water uh, Pulse do? Okay, it did pretty good, so I'm gonna keep using that. Well, this is the final Pokemon that uh, Giovanni gets, and after that, you can just move away. By the way, I'm also gonna get some uh, of these other things, like. Um, Sorry, Giovanni, but yeah, it is. Oh, whoops. I meant to, of course, obtain the Silph Scope. This is, of course, gonna be needed in case uh, we, of course, uh... wait. This is, of course, needed to, to investigate the ghost, because that was a mistake uh, from me before. Now we're gonna use Team Yoshi's Dig and leave. Well, luckily, this uh, gate and the Pokemon Center is right there. Yeah, thank God, because I do want my Pokemon healed. Alright. Now, one of the things that I am going to be doing is, of course, uh, putting a uh, Primate Ape into the front of the party. Oh, yeah, because uh, what is the Pokemon that uh, the ghost uh, gets turned into? It's a Marowak, and, ev and it kills everybody except, uh, of course, um... Donkey Kong, so we're gonna put... Okay, Donkey Kong is already at the front. Perfect. Let me just uh, get quickly to uh, Route 8 back. If I uh, do enter this thing good. I'm not sure why we aren't even using the bicycle. Yeah, I'm just gonna put... I'm just gonna use the bicycle. Bicycle's literally just as fast as running, but yeah, I don't care. Where? And by the way, I didn't know this, but in Lavender Town there is a uh, Pokemon, uh, Pokemart, which is right there. And here's where we're, of course, going to be buying a bunch of stuff, especially these great balls. 
We need a lot of them because we're going to be catching a Pokemon that I really need. And we're going to also get a bunch of these Super Potions. Let me just get seven of them. And I definitely need to get a lot of Paralysis Heals. I'm just going to get 15. Oh, uh, let me get also some Burn Heals just in case. We don't need any escape ropes. I'm definitely going to be selling a bunch of this stuff. Some things like... Yeah, Edders. Yes. Stardust. I don't... Yeah. And I'm also going to get a uh, star piece sold. Yes. And the pearl. And of course the nugget. The moonstone. Well, I mean, it's useful for healing a... Uh, uh, the female Nidoran, but I'm not really care. I don't really care for that. We also need to get a lot more revives, so let me just buy that as well. And let me also get high ice heal just in case. And I'm gonna buy eight of them. All right, and now also get some super repels. Yep, super repels are also mandatory. And I really gotta hope for that five Super Balls is probably gonna be enough for the last Pokemon member, because I do know exactly what to catch after I get the Poke Flute. Well, you do need to, uh, you probably do need to use Repels in order to get out of here. Yeah, not here, but later. Here is where I have to use a Repel. I'm just going to be using the regular ones, because of course, uh, the Super Repels, they have to be... I'm only using them for like... Um, yeah, I'm using them only for the f Safari Zone, but I don't know where it is. Because we need the Safari Zone in order to access the move Surf. Yeah, you do also need to get uh, Charizard unlocked so you can teach it Fly. Yeah, true. And yeah, he was uh, pretty soon the ghost that I wasn't able to uh, battle. And here's the purification zone. Well, yeah, I'm sorry if I am always going the wrong way. Let me just now use another repel. And sorry if I keep moving on the screen. It's not my intention. By the way, the ghost is right about here. So yeah, this is why I needed the Sil Scope. I was getting way too ahead of myself. But here it is. This is why we need to use the Sil Scope, because now there's the ghost. And now it's a Marowak. Well... How much does... Uh, well, we're gonna be using Brick Break. Well, it, it did pretty good damage. How much does Aerial Ace do? Not, not good enough. Okay, you gotta be a little bit careful. Well, two more Brick Breaks would do it. He used his Focus Energy, well that didn't work. And the Marowak is dead, so I can just uh, now go ahead and defeat the Rocket Grunts. Well, Donkey Kong is now level 30. Alright, now finally the ghost is done, and now let's face the rocket grunts. Yeah, now we are... Uh, you do need to face like three of them. Yes, and then I can rescue the man. I did have a prime ape in the front, but... Um, I'm soon gonna uh, switch train, uh, of course, um, the Charmander. Yeah, very good. By the way, after this video I'm going to be showering. Yeah, good idea. Okay, that does a lot of damage. Let's just use one more Seismic Toss and then switch into Ch uh, Ch Charmeleon. Because I need to upgrade him to a Charizard pretty soon. Yeah, he is decent per level, but not decent enough. Yeah, true. He's only, he's level 23. He's the lowest one out of all of the Pokemon. But yeah, I also n never was able to level up Brownie. Yeah, true. I'm just going to be switching into a Blastoise to make the fights a little bit go faster, because one bite equals literally one instant death from uh, a Zubat. Yeah, even at, even at level 25, no chance. Yep, and Blastoise is now level 4. Wait. Yeah, sorry about that. 
a gold bat. Well, that is uh, a lot of XP. Definitely. You, you should also keep Charmeleon uh, into the front of the party. Definitely. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to attack with uh, Charmeleon. But I mean, that's fine. Alright, move into Blastoise. Good idea, because I mean, you don't want uh, Charmeleon to faint. Oh, definitely not. Charmeleon uh, uh, cannot faint. And apparently Golpat is uh, capable of uh, taking a bite, not the actual one. Oh, whoops. Let me just uh, put the full screen. And now um, Charmeleon is level 24. Well, now just uh, switch... Um, I just switched um, Charmeleon to the front of the party. That's exactly what I'm about to do. There you go. Let me also use a uh, super potion on the on the on Donkey Kong though. All right, let me check where the super potions are. There they are. There you go. All right, let's see what you have, Mr. Uh, Rocket Grunt. Well, after this there is one more, then you're probably done. Yeah, I'm gonna catch a Pokemon in the next episode. Oh, and just the coughing? Well, it's time to switch into Team Yoshi again. Yeah, the poison types are the most annoying types, of course. But that's why they have me, of course, there. Yeah, because Smog literally does one HP damage. Exactly, literally. These uh, things are not good. Yeah, Trash uh, is a two-hit KO, and of course they have to sm use Smoke Stream, Scream, because it's very annoying. Luckily, Trash landed. I w thought that it was going to miss. Oh no, self-destruct. Thankfully, it didn't kill off uh, Team Yoshi. Yes, we're going to be switching. We're switching into Blastoise, because I want to, of course, uh, let... I'm just going to let them take damage. Because I'm going to be using a Super Potion on Team Yoshi. Very good. Because, I mean, I do want to keep him alive. Yeah, I never used to move uh, Stupid uh, Drowsy. And just like that, it's a one-hit KO. Although I couldn't uh, level up Charmeleon, it's fine. Well, that Rocket Grunt is done for. Just, uh, just one more Rocket Grunt left. Well, there it is. You're not saving anyone, kids. Well, I definitely will, uh, Mr. Rocket Grunt. You can't tell me what to do. Oh, this thing has four Pokemon. Are you sure you're going to be able to finish it off in time? Well, with Blastoise uh, being there, then I definitely can. Okay, good, because I do want to uh, make sure that you're uh, doing it on time, because you are a couple of seconds behind the stopwatch. Yeah, one uh, bite is definitely going to be a one-hit KO against the Zubat. No chance of surviving. Yep. And so we're going to be using another Zubat, so mm, just switch to range Charmeleon, and then you eventually can get up to the levels. Yeah, he is halfway to level 25, and he can learn Flamethrower at level 34. Which is definitely going to be useful, because just Ember is not good enough. Yeah, true. And, yeah, I don't know what that move was. Just going to be using Bite once again. That's, that's the goal, of course. Well, a Rotata. Bruh, even Charmeleon can take on the Rattata, I believe. It probably can. I mean, with Metal Claw, you can probably do it. Let's see. Well, it did half. Oh, this Rattata has focus energy, so we gotta be a little bit careful. It uses Tail Weep. Why? I mean... Okay. Okay, thank goodness uh, it didn't do a lot of damage. And now Charmeleon is... Uh... Now Charmeleon's attack uh, uh, went up. Eradicate. Seriously? I can literally take this thing also on with, uh, of course, uh, Metal Claw. Well, now it's time to switch out. Because it's not smart to keep him there. That's exactly what I'm gonna do, but we're uh, running out of time. You know what? 
After you defeat the Raticate, just exit the video. Yeah, I definitely should. Let, let's just use Blight. Hopefully it kills. And it did. Good. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you all enjoyed today's Pokemon adventure once again. If you do, leave a like down below and subscribe. If you have any, uh, if you like the gameplay, then let me know in the comments below as well. And we'll see you all next time. Yes, bye everyone!